The centre currently houses 89 inmates and 5 babies. The Commissioner General of the Namibian Correctional Service, Rafael Hamunyela, said at the event. Hamunyela mentioned that the facility has a child-friendly area designed to provide a harmonic environment for children under the age of 2 years to assist in strengthening and building bonds with their mothers. The centre is meant to provide female offenders access to social and educational programs that give them an opportunity to rehabilitate and reintegrate back into society as law-abiding citizens. These programs, of course, take into cognizance the uniqueness of women and their distinctiveness in their motives to perpetrate crimes. Lady Monica Ginkos pledged to furnish the facilities to host babies within the centre. Many of the women who become incarcerated, they come in either with small babies or they come in already pregnant. And until the age of two, it's critical for a mother to be with a child, whether it's for breastfeeding or just for bonding purposes. So a lot of people normally flag, but why are there babies in prisons? There's a lot of health reasons and economic and social reasons why. And often these are single mothers who are the primary caregivers of these babies and they have nobody to give these babies to. And that is why it's important to make sure that the babies are as well looked after as the mothers are. Amunyela urged potential stakeholders to support the Namibia Correctional Services in the implementation of its mandate of providing safe, secure and human custody of offenders. We are requesting you to provide employment for those that are least. The government is giving us money to implement rehabilitation programs, but yet neither government nor you want to employ the offenders. Why do you want us to, to, to give rehabilitation programs? He stated that they are confident that with the support of the stakeholders, the sender will release well rehabilitated female offenders. For Nampa TV, Linea Dishena, Ventuk.